Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and the Flacco Group PETA uh, is now saying that milk is a symbol of white supremacy. So now you're a white supremacist if you uh, drink milk. Well, <laughs> what about beer? White supremacists drink beer, too. So is everybody who drinks beer a white supremacist? Uh, what about orange juice? White supremacists eat, drink orange juice, too. Does that make everybody who drinks orange juice a white supremacist? I can go on and on, folks. They're insane. Peter's shenanigans vary from the absurd to the downright offensive. From likening rape survivors to pigs and cows, to calling Pokemon a form of animal cruelty, PETA's efforts to save the animals always make the headlines, and with good reason. They're completely absurd. You know it's bad if Heat Street. Heat Street is a liberal rag, and even they don't, even they, uh, don't like this. The animal rights group today released a new video to cry over milk, equating the nutritious drink with Nazism. Following the rise of in Trump derangement syndrome and the progressive left's hysteria over white supremacists, PETA states, Do you know that milk has long been a symbol used by white supremacists? It's an al alternative fact accompanied by an equally ludicrous video in which they published on social media. They call milk the neo-Nazi drink of choice, stating that it's been a long been a symbol used by white suprem supremacist groups as thinly veiled allegory for racial purity. Oh boy. Unbelievable. The backup statement, they even say, say it played a prominent role in the Jordan Peele's race comedy Get Out, which with quotes from the director. It follows some Secretly captured and horrifying footage of cows being mishandled, manhandled and abused by farmer, factory farm workers, so your discretion is advised. I'm not going to that video. So, how did the association of white supremacy and the milk even come about? Perhaps the answer lies in uh, Inglorious, you know what's Hans Landa's film of delicious milk. There's a video out there of white supremacists drinking milk, and that's actually where it comes from. But I'll show you the uh, tweet on pit Twitter just to show you that people aren't making this up. And it should be said that uh, I tried posting videos and stuff on my chat room and some things were going horribly wrong, things I've never seen before. So I'm not sure what's going on with that. Right here it is. PETA. Did you know that milk has long been a symbol used by white supremacists? Well, here's that video they mentioned. I didn't intend to go to video because it is kind of nasty. Alright, I put that on hold. I'm not a rancher. I don't want to deal with this with uh, cows and stuff, so. It just won't stop. You put it on hold and it starts back up again. You get the point. Uh, this is not internet BS. They, people are not making this up. This act, They actually have said this. Do you, did you know that milk has long been a symbol used by white supremacists? So now you're a white supremacist. If you drink milk. And because white supremacists also drink beer. 
it's safe to say white supremacists eat peas, so you can't eat those, right? Or is it just the fact that it's white colored? What about white potatoes? Are you going to uh, say those are uh, symbols of white supremacy too? You people are insane. Well, as for cows being abused, no, I'm not for that. Well, that's not the thrust of this video. I'm not a rancher. I don't know how things are done there, so... Sorry, but, uh... You people are insane. There's no other way to put it. If you honestly think that people drink milk because it's a symbol of white supremacy, then the people at PETA who think this need to be put into nut houses. They need to go to mental hospitals because they're out of their minds. You're insane. And I have no problem say, saying it. I'm going to say it one more time. You're insane. This is all leftism, folks. These are leftists who just want to tear down capitalism and our free way of life. That's all they are. In fact, I, I heard a story, I haven't checked it out, about some uh, PETA animal shelter or something where they kill 90% of them. So these people have no claim to being for animals. I'm sorry, they don't. I'm Artifacts Mars. Thanks for watching.